Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am super excited to show you this bag I just finished hand sewing. I'm actually really impressed with it and I can't get over how gorgeous and luxurious it is. It was really simple to make and even easy to start in hand sew and even beginners can like smoothly complete this bag. Anyway, it's a DIY kit that I got from Babylon Leather and I linked it below if you'd like to get one yourself and or explore their other bags. Again, super impressed by this bag. So it's not my design, but I enjoyed hand sewing it. Look at it. I honestly can't get over it. So here's what my leather tote DIY kit came with. You get a little pamphlet telling you about Babylon Leather and some QR codes to check out their website. But what I especially liked was the itemized list with the QR code that leads you directly to their tutorial showing you step by step how to put together the bag. All right, more specifically, this kit comes with everything you need so you don't have to buy anything. All right, checking it out. This is the free little gift they give you, which I guess you can hang on your finished tote if you prefer, really adorable. And then all of these cowhide leather pieces have been already pre-cut for you. And they all have pinholes around them that are precise, so it makes it super easy, like really super easy to sew this thing together. And that zipper there was like beyond luxurious. So this is my inner slip pocket. And then I ordered the version with the metal handles because I really like this look. I love the look of caramel leather with gold, um, just gold, gold hardware. Again, all the pre-cut pieces and you can see how perfectly and precise these holes are cut for your hand sewing. And then there's more goodies here. You get uh, all these things. I'm telling you, you don't need to buy a thing. So here are the leather straps, pre-cut and made for you to just screw right onto the finished bag. And you'll see how I do that in a few moments. And you also get your thread that has a wax coating on it and made specifically for leather. And then these nippers, I love the nippers. They had me at the nippers, awesome. Can't believe that they send you that. More gold hardware for um, putting on the straps and then a clip to hold your pieces together. Very sturdy needles with large eyes and a screwdriver to help you with the bottom feet here, or I'm not really sure what this hardware is called, but it is for the bottom of the bag. And now we'll show you a quick and modified version of the steps I took from beginning to end to create this gorgeous leather tote. So this stitch that I'm doing right here, I followed their tutorial and they showed me exactly how to create it. So again, if you are a beginner sewer, don't even be reluctant on ordering one of these kits. Really easy instructions. After sewing the two front panels together, I'm going to attach now the interior bottom of the bag. I am sewing with two needles, so your thread actually has a needle on both ends. And this way, you're creating sort of like a back stitch so that you have a really solid looking running stitch.
after this has been fully sewn on, I'm going to apply these little, what I call feet, the gold hardware that go under the bag. Really simple. You just put it through the pre cut holes and you just screw it on. And with the uh, screwdriver they provided, super easy. Next, I'm going to apply the zipper on the very top with the interior slip pocket. What may look like a challenging experience really wasn't. But the only thing is here, you are sewing through three layers, so you just wanna make sure you always go through the correct pre-cut hole. Other than that, it is the same stitch and all three layers of fabric were attached easily. At this point, I was trying to figure out the easiest way for me to hold all the layers of the leather as I attach them together. This is looking gorgeous so far. And now I'm just double checking that I'm putting the right sides of the leather together. And now I'm gonna use the same stitch that I've been using for the entire bag. The clip they provide does come in handy.
And as I sew the curves, it's actually really simple. You just want to make sure you don't miss a single hole. All right, I have both my sides sewn on and the bag is looking almost complete. So I'm going to open it up and turn it right sides out. All right, let's attach the handles. So before I do that, I'm gonna sew this leather piece right up here on top of both of the gold handles. And it really adds a gorgeous finishing touch. At the end of each thread cutting, you are supposed to put a drop of glue. You can also knot it if you don't want to use the glue. So here is how you attach the metal and leather handles. And that's it. This bag came out unbelievable. I still can't believe I hand sewed it. So if you really want to try one yourself, go ahead and visit BabylonLeather.com and order your style and start making it. And if you really enjoyed this video, go ahead and check out my other videos right up here on the screen. Please give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks again for watching.